Oh, no. Robert Oppenheimer was lonely. So you decided to get the whole Manhattan Project? Yes. This is Enrico Fermi, Richard Feynman, Edward Teller, Otto Frisch. Zazzles. Zazzles? I was going to name him Hermann von Helmholtz, but he's so zazzy. Okay, we need to talk. About what? Cats, Sheldon. You're clearly upset about Amy being gone, and you're trying to replace her with a bunch of cats. Clowder. What? A group of cats is a clowder. Or a glaring. Okay, yeah, fine. That's the kind but... of thing you ought to know, now that we have one. <laughs> uh, fine. Live with cats. Be like my Aunt Nancy. She had dozens of them. You know what happened after she died? They ate her. You don't have to sell me on cats, Leonard. I'm already a fan. <laughs> Hi, Mrs. Cooper. Thanks for coming. Where is he? He's in his bedroom. Now, when you said on the phone he broke up with a girl, you meant an actual girl, not something you kids whipped up in a lab. No, she's real. Did they sin? No, no, it's not like that. It's, uh... I don't know what it's like. But there is something I should prepare you for. Oh, relax, Leonard. I have raised that boy. I have seen him at his best. I've seen him at his worst. There's nothing he can do that'll surprise me. Hold on to that thought. Ben. Surprise. Mom, what an unexpected pleasure. My, my, that's a powerful smell. I'd like you to meet Oppenheimer, Frisch, Panofsky, Feynman, Wisecock. Yeah, I get it. You got a lot of cats and you gave them cute Jewish names. What are you doing here? Leonard called. He said that you were pining for a young lady. This little guy here, I think you'll find to be quite zazzy. <laughs> you should have called sooner. Shelly, dinner's ready. Coming. No cats. <laughs> what is she doing here? I called her. Your mother thinks you might be losing your mind over me. As a neurobiologist, I was curious. Well, rest assured, I am in full possession of my faculties. 25 cats! 